welcome to Dice Quest. My name is Maddie, and I play Vendi Underboro. Um, so I if you guys want to do that, you're also welcome to. That's probably a good idea, and they might already have ways to get there, to the places that they want to get the things. I don't know why I don't trust the Divine Watch. <laughs> Every time we go back to them, I'm ready to fight. They were in Snowcastle. Okay. At oh, least they were headed that way. Oh, yeah. But we... We need to get more information before we go to Snowdrop. So we should probably go to the library in Snowdrop, because isn't that the closest place? Snowfall. I disagree. We should get more information on the cult. So you think we should spy more and get we like, should be chased by hellhounds again? Out of the occult yes. Head dude except for that. Except for maybe let's not get let's let's not get caught ask him this questions. Time. Look. <laughs> yeah, let's not get caught this time. We can try, but it sounds sketchy. Okay. I I think if we want to. To research the largest libraries in this kingdom, at least. I've heard her in Snowcastle. Okay. I would assume. So we should get more information um, on the cult. We should spy more. Okay. Because what, what, do we know anything about the cult right now? They were we going in the were, water? Uh, we they're know that looking, they were looking, they're looking for, for the temple. Stuff. I found one of the stuff. There's two more stuff. So are they going to pack um, up now that they notice that the um, water's cold? Mm, MacGuffins! Ah, yeah, MacGuffins. They, the legend of the MacGuffins. You guys know um, what MacGuffins are? Yes, I do. They're they're just plot devices. They're like Deus Ex Machina. I have no idea Machina, what a MacGuffin is. They're 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 and um like, they're items that uh that the characters have to go find. Basically, because they gotta like, go find them. I only ah. learned that word because it's in you meet in a tavern podcast, which is mm-hmm. bloody amazing. Listen to it. Um, <laughs> I back it. Don't pop. No, don't it's so the good that like, it totally different tone. So it like much more comical than this. Yeah, but like it, it's really good. Okay, that reminded me. Um, I have gotten in contact with someone on Fiverr who's willing to make music for this podcast. Oh, cool! Oh, awesome! So hundred bucks. Oh, cool! Cool! Yeah. So, if you guys want to help us buy music, because music <laughs> is expensive, like we're getting nine different songs, each of them like fourteen. Oh wow! Song. Damn. Really? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> have you so, have you heard like, this guy's stuff before? Uh, no, but he sent me a sample because he was like, "What do you want?" And I was like, "Um, like something two steps from hell, like oh. like think like Skyrim background music." And he was like, "How about I send you a sample?" <laughs> and I was like, "Yeah." And he's like, the next day he sent me a 90 second long sample. And dear God, I didn't want it to end. It was so good. It was, it was, That's awesome. it was so good. And apparently he's like brand new to Fiverr. He's out of India. Oh my God. It's so good. I'm so we're so thinking excited. like background music, like kind of Skyrim. Yeah. Cool. Like, and it, like if I had been told that was from two steps from hell, I would have totally believed really? it. Really? Damn. Like, I, Yeah. <laughs> It, it's really good. Oh my god. I'm trying to remember his name. I'll, I'll put it in in post, but yeah. Um, Laya also says, but um, I heard some mention of gods. Uh, I've heard the largest like um, churches and cathedrals are in Silverkeep. Hmm. So they're both on the eastern end of do you have a here. map? I do. It's literally right here. Here. Well, we could split up, and half of us go to the Divine Watch, and the other half goes to Would some churches. Like I vote not going to churches because I, uh, I, I'd probably fuck something up. Snowcastle's all the way on the other end. Yeah. Like literally as far away from us as possible, because there's a cursed lake, and Snowcastle is here. Oh, that's really far. Where's Snowdrop? There's no fall. It's yeah, it's snowfall. It's not I snowdrop. swore it was snowdrop. Or is that the inn? No. No, I'm pretty sure it was snowfall. We we've called it incorrect. We've incorrectly named it today, but I'm pretty sure we got it right previously. Oh, was it okay. snowfall? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. We might have gotten it wrong we probably previously. Did. And yeah, we're way the hell done. away. Someone yeah, on Twitter, like on the- fucking. Yell at Jack for uh, not getting his shit right. <laughs> yeah. And for letting us get all <laughs> yeah. shit wrong. 
Just kidding, don't do that. Jack How is great. many days travel would that be straight? Depends if you want to take boat or walk. We, can take we don't boat. have a boat. Would a boat yeah. be shorter? It would be shorter because boats can travel twenty four seven, whereas people can walk for eight hours. I mean, we a day. destroyed a little bit of our boat, but it can still. No, let's it's, not use it's that. Not boat. Floatable. It's like, not floatable. Like you would anyway. pay like a boat. Oh, like to a take ferry or something. Not not like a ferry, probably like we would a merchant probably take ship. Like a shi- merchant ship. Yeah. Do you think we should take a ship then? <sighs> we would have to go to the nearest port city. I don't think there's going to be ships in Snowfall, will there? There, there have been some ships, like, large ones considering the size of the town. Not immense, like, not man of We also need money. Or galleys. <laughs> I have yeah. money, I just stole She has a shit ton of money. Of the I have ten dollars. I have two hundred and fifteen gold on top of whatever I had before that. Okay, and then you also have to, um, the gold stuff to sell. Oh yeah, I was going to give Vanny the, the circuit. circuit. Circlet? Circlet. Yeah. Okay. I was just gonna put it on your head, like, have this. Yay! <laughs> um. I got a circlet! Now I'm fancy as hell! With a foot in your Yay! bag. Yay! <laughs> you oh, know wait. what? Sometimes <laughs> fancy people need feet. <laughs> Alright. No one's gonna comment on that. What's the plan, team? Should we start heading back to Snowfall? Um? Or no, you wanted to spy on the camp. Yeah, I think we should get more information. Um, but do you think they're gonna pack up now that they notice something's wrong with the lake? That's probably a good time to kidnap one of their members. I don't know. Maybe. And then if we injured get Isaac caught, doesn't know anything take, anymore, he could be lying. Um, was he lying, um, Vanny? There was a couple of persuasions that I couldn't get him to verify, but from what I understand, is he didn't know a lot. There was a lot of pieces missing. Okay. But if we stick around, if we get caught again, they're going to get the sword. Good point. That's we should true. throw the sword back in the lake. No! <laughs> <laughs> we worked so hard. Laya kind of agrees with these two that it's better to keep whatever they want as far away from them as possible. Maybe I shouldn't go spy. Also, I should put my armor back on. That's something yes, I did. That's something I just kind of assumed you had done okay, that. Okay, cool. <laughs> do, do you want to start heading back to Snowfall? Like, kind of split up? I think that's that might be a good idea. And then... Will you be okay traveling alone, though? So, you should probably take somebody with you. Just in case. Like, There's... Lyra. I can. I could take Lyra with me. Uh, but we're the ones who got caught last here's the time. Thing. Good point. Here's the thing, though. <laughs> when should I expect you back in Snowfall? Because if you're not there by then, I'm going to go to the camp and I'm going to find you. What if we stay just one night and see if they're packing up and what they're doing? I think it would be best if we all stick together. So Jack doesn't have to keep track no, of us like, all in different is saying this. Yeah, no, no I like, get I'm it. totally fine to do this. But, like, if y'all remember from session one... When I gave, when I told y'all that it was very, da- actually before session one, session it was zero. very da- dangerous to go out alone in the wilderness. Like you guys probably haven't been attacked by very many, very many animals because you have numbers. <laughs> but it's like if there's one or two of you, pack of wolves might be a bit interested. Mm-hmm. That's a good point. All right, what I suggest is that we keep Rangram here. With the boat, and me, the wizard, and the elf what? go scouting for a little bit. That's still alone in the wilderness. <laughs> That's the same thing. That's <laughs> the same problem. The but you were fine you last time. If you no, you had Laya. Jump into the lake. I hate water. Yeah, well, it sucks Why? to suck. Oh, you're fire. <laughs> I, I grew up in a mountain. Well, in a hill. You're a hill dwarf. I grew up on a hill. <laughs> I worship a fire god. <laughs> I, I grew up on a hill. You're kind you of like me do hobbit this. hole style houses. <laughs> okay, I grew up in a hobbit hole. I have. A f- I worship fire. So of course you I said hate water. that this whole plain, though, is like devout of trees around it like, for a while. There are like the occasional tree, but none are super close to this lake. Like the closest one to you guys is probably like two miles out, and it's not very big. 
So maybe you should just stay by the tree. Or you should stay very far away from the trees, out. then you can see what's coming out. The wolves you. are going to be in the trees. Not if there's one. Well, there's never going to be one wolf. No, I mean one tree. Don't you I want to stay far. I think f if I was going to stay alone, I would want to stay far away from the trees. Also, I have a fire sword, so I could just fire. You haven't even attempted like, yeah, it. I have a wolf. <laughs> 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 Uh, hold up, hold up. Let me put a marker down. There we go. Alright. Gonna isolate that on you. <laughs> ah, wolf! Oh, wolf. Uh, Alright. So we're um, all arguing about what to do. That's the fun about this game. We get to argue with each other. Um, here's the deal. I don't think we should go scouting. Because I kind of suck at it. And we should probably have two people stay together. <laughs> These two seem like um, Lyas lived in the wilderness, and in, you seem in pretty, the woods. In the woods, okay. And <laughs> Not you woods. seem pretty sneaky. Um, and Vanny, um, you like you 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 knife people in the dark. <laughs> knife you, people in you, the dark. You 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 good at sneaking. Um, maybe we should stick together here, and Vanny and. Laya can head out, and then we'll just have to worry about wolves. Okay. Alright, I'm down. Be safe. All At right. least I know Lyra okay. will bail me out of whatever I get into. Hopefully. Hopefully. <laughs> Maybe. That's always dangerous when you pull up a book. <laughs> Pay no attention to the man behind the screen. <laughs> <laughs> Jack's just basically like, alright, well, I get to roll random encounters now. <laughs> Uh, Mind Flare, right, guys? <laughs> so, uh, you guys know uh, the stats for Displacer Beast, right? <laughs> no? Well, uh, that sucks. Uh, uh, white Dragon? Uh, adult? <laughs> I actually did just notice that you have this dragon on your desk, and it's really right? cool. It's really cool, isn't it's it? Really cool. It's beautiful. Is that a gargantuan? That is an ancient white dragon. Oh, it's so, pretty. so one of my parties is going to going off into the mountains to fight one of these. Good luck with that. Uh, 14th level party, and they're they're going after a dragon and its lair. Are you gonna paint it? Eventually, yeah. But I want to like get really good at painting before I touch. I understand something it's that was a so thirty dollar mini. <laughs> yeah. Uh, the, that is majestic. Though. It's so cool. Look at Which it, is though. literally why it's on my desk because it's like yeah. just so cool. I feel like we're gonna need a picture I'm a nerd. for yeah. I'll I'll post a picture for on, the media of the social. Yeah, I'll fellows. put I'll put a picture on social. I'm I love um, dragons, and too. I'll just tell that because like the parties haven't seen this many yet. Like whenever I think we're gonna take it, I put it in like a cooler. Like a handful oh, cooler, yeah. and just carry it to the <laughs> session. And at the start, I like place the cooler on the table, and I'm like, "You guys get to see what's inside." At some point. At some point. <laughs> I remember you showed me that one day, yeah. and you were like, "No one else can know what's in there." <laughs> yeah. Because like the other two people that were playing that day, and it was really that weird group. that you said that about a cooler. Oh, but what was inside is beautiful. Yeah, I think it's funny that it's also a white dragon in a cooler. That's true. <laughs> it's in its natural habitat. Yeah, there you go. Okay. So, Vanny and Laya, you guys start heading yep. south? Okay. How long do you guys plan on being gone? Um, let's say three hours. Three, three hours? hours? Where is my travel pace? I don't know. How long Let's does it take us to get to the other side of, of the lake? Map. <laughs> if it's longer than three hours, it'll be gone longer than three hours. Um, last time it took you just under a day. We will most definitely to be get there from longer here. than three hours. So when should we expect you back? Um... If you don't see us within three days, then there's problems. Okay. Okay. Laya agrees, because it's about two days round trip, and we want to watch for a little while. Okay. So if we don't see you in three days, we'll go to the camp. Sounds yeah. good to me. 
Okay. All right. See you cool. in three days. Three days. All right. You guys make your way down south. And what are you two doing? We chilling? S- set up a fire. Not yet. It's not done. I mean, it. It's, you're cold. It's cold, though. Like... Oh, because the... But we don't want to burn the whole boat if we're going to be here for three days. It's unfloatable. Like... Can I just, like, light my sword on fire and put it in the ground? Yeah. You need to be pretty close to stay warm from it. Okay. But, like, like within five feet and you feel the heat. Okay. Do you want to just do that? We can, like, okay. when we get cold. Do you say anything clever I'm gonna do that. when you light I don't... Huh? the sword on fire? Do you say anything clever when you light the sword on fire? Because <laughs> there's a reference dangling right there. My Dude, dick's I, on I fire. Flame on! <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic Four. Jack, no. <laughs> You're just like, dick on fire, Sorry, and that's then all it lights I am on at fire. This point. Right. No, it's flame on. I um I think anyway. I get Fantastic that. Four is Flame On because it's yeah. Johnny Storm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Anyway, light so it on guys, fire. Okay, you're just sitting around the fire. I sword. actually don't need to, but you can. Thanks. No problem. I'm just dying. Sitting around the fire sword. Yes. Okay. Chilling. <laughs> All right. It's like a bonfire in Dark Souls. <laughs> Here, rest at the flame. <laughs> Laya, Vanny, and you guys rest is flat, head down flag. south. Yep. South. It's been about a day of walking. You guys can see off in the distance some decent sized flames. All right. Uh, my since we've been walking for about a day, let's take a short rest. Okay. So you're gonna hang out here yeah. for an hour. All right. Also, thinking about Dark Souls, I've been playing that game, and holy shit, am I a noob. It's kicked my ass. Yeah, I got past the tutorial and Fort. And Fort. <laughs> uh, he's a little ice dog, um, and I haven't really gotten much further than <laughs> oh my that. God. I, I I'm like still at the Fort. Like I keep trying yeah, to make my boyfriend I, I, play I with play me, so I, uh, I finally succeed. Unless it's like but D&D, he's, then I like he's stressing refused. out. <laughs> you like stressing he's out told me people. to get good. <laughs> no, like, even when I play, I like to stress out. <laughs> Fun. Yeah, I don't it's, know. It's what makes it fun to me, but like, I don't like to stress out for video games. Dark That's Souls is fun, relax. but like for me, it's like the wrong kind of confusing. <laughs> mm. I guess. Like, I don't mind being confused and not knowing where to go in a game, but like, I don't like just like being kind of confused and then just getting my ass handed yeah, to me for hours, yeah. and then just being like, okay, maybe I'll explore this way, and then just dying, being like, okay, all right, um, yeah. Anyway, anyway. that's a tangent. So, Vanny, Laya, you to wake up. And these flames seem to have ceased. You do see some smoke rising from where they were. Okay. Uh, what time is it right now? I'm going to head over there. Uh, after that hour, it's getting to dusk. Like, sun will probably set in about an hour. Okay. Um, I kind of want to get a little bit closer to the camp, but I want to sneak very carefully just in case there's doggos. Okay. Make stealth checks. <laughs> Well, you make one, Laya will make the other. Okay, oh god, please don't fuck me. Got okay. So, JJ and I played earlier today. We both played. It was a ton of fun, I was playing a wizard. Anyway, I could not roll for shit earlier. Dude, we almost got our asses kicked by some orcs. I was a monk, and I was just, like, hiding in the corner throwing darts at people, (laughs) because I had one health. (laughs) But, like, now I'm rolling pretty well. Like, that was a solid... 22 stealth for Lyle. Okay, Damn. I got Lyle, a, I'm happy Lyle's rolling well. I got a 17, well. I've right? had my modifier, yeah. so hold on. Right. Uh, where is my stealth? You both sneak, 17 will do it. What? Maddie. You don't need to math. Oh, I don't? That 17 okay. will do it. So, you both sneak closer, and as you get closer, you do see that all these tents that once were are now heaps of ash. Hmm. Smoldering ash. Lovely. You don't see any signs of life anywhere. Did Dan kill them all? They probably burned all their Dan shit. Dan was an He was working yeah. for them. Dan the Warlock um, already sold his vitamins. <laughs> so. <laughs> okay, uh, can we go down to the camp and explore a little bit more, but sneaky? Sure. You go into the camp, what do you want to look for? Any sign of life. <laughs> Uh, make an investigation. Actually, make a perception oh, check. I got a seven. 
you find no such signs of life, like the journey song. Oh, excuse me, like the journey no. song. Signs of life. <laughs> nice. Okay. Can I see yeah. if they've left anything behind, like books, papers, clothing, anything? Make a- another perception check. That's a nine. You find no such books, papers, or clothings. Can you see anyone leaving? Can I see anyone leaving? Or, like, any evidence of where someone might have gone? To me, as a player, it seems like they noticed the lake was cold, realized the sword was gone, and they torched the camp, and they're trying to find us. That would be a good idea. Um, can I see any footsteps anywhere? Like trail marks. Make a survival check. Me? No, No, me. Vanny, make a survival. Uh, I thought we got random encountered. No, that would be a perception. Hold on, let me see. That's a that's a crisp old ten. All right, with a 10, you do not see any. Well, you see quite a lot of footprints, but you can't quite make out where they're Can I ask Lyra? She seems like she's capable at hunting and things. She says, I mean, vaguely east, but... I don't think I'll be able to follow them very far, and she points out east. And you see a snowstorm rolling towards you. Shit. Well. We gone die. Yeah, they're gone. I don't even know what uh, to do since they're gone. Uh. Um. Is it possible I'm that more worried we about the snowstorm. This snowstorm <laughs> or are we going to, like, die? I mean, as long as we have some heat, we'll be fine. And... Uh... Uh, well, from what I understand is there's not a lot of forestation. Is there any forest near the east? Um, off east, we could get to a forest. It's quite a ways away, like a few days. Well, we told them so we'd back, the be back be on day the three. Yeah. Uh, I, by her guess, the storm's going to be here in a day. All right. There's also a forest to the south by southeast of you. Well, let's try and walk to the forest closest to us and try and... Closest to you guys would be north. (laughs) Well, let's try that and find either A, shelter, or B, warmth via sticks on fire. You guys start walking back north? Can we see the storm? Yeah. Okay. It looks like a day and a half out from you guys. All right. You guys walk a little further north, and pretty soon night rolls around. Okay. Uh, I'm going to suggest we build an actual fire for the night. Well, yeah. Do we have any boat left? Do we have any boat left? Yeah. Okay. Like, you guys didn't even use half of the boat okay, yesterday. Sweet. Well, we didn't use any during the day. Okay, yeah. I'm going to... um take my hammer, chop up some wood, make a little fire, light it with the sword, then give the sword back, and then put the sword back. Like, in the bonfire. Okay. Uh, Where you had put the sword earlier, Mm -hmm. the snow had melted away, just revealing very muddy dirt, Mm -hmm. because all of the snow on top of it had melted. Nice. So. Cool, we have muddy dirt. You now have a patch of mud. Cool! Rub it on your faces. It's probably going to freeze if you don't Put that sword back right there. Uh, <laughs> I'll put the fire where the mud is and then put okay. the sword back. I mean, it won't really matter if it freezes. It's going to get snowed over in it two days. Yeah. But. Alright. So, Vanny, Laya, what are you two doing for warmth? So, let's find some sticks. Fallen sticks, hopefully. Or half-dead trees. Cut them with... I have a sword, don't I? Kind of like a rapier thing. Mm. Let me double check. Did I he think... get taken? Or he escaped? Yeah, I don't think you grabbed anything when you escaped. Shh. Any of your Shit. weapons. You have a small knife. Well, I guess... Uh... I remember that, because that was yeah, one of your thieves' tools. Yeah, we went and got our stuff. Yeah, we grabbed our stuff. Didn't You guys grabbed your stuff oh. as you were running away. And oh, then hopped did... on the boat. Did they not Annie get didn't grab any of her stuff. 
Oh, you shoot. You grabbed your orb and, or your crystal. I can't remember which one it was. And one of your daggers. Mm-hmm. You grabbed your sword, your hammer, and your shield. And so we don't have any rations. <laughs> no, like, they only took your weapons. Oh, got okay. it. Um, well, I guess I'm going to use this tiny-ass dagger to cut mm. some sticks. All right, make a survival check to see if you can find any of these twigs you speak I of. I got an 18. All right. You find a few, probably enough to burn for about an hour. Okay, well, uh, it's better than nothing. Laya's going to suggest you, like, kind of set these up like a torch and then walk through the night, because at least the movement will help keep you warm. Sounds good to me. And then everyone else, everyone, go through a ration. Okay. Gone through a ration. That'll be the end of the day. And do you guys carry on through the night, Laya and Vanny? Alrighty. Do you guys carry oh, on through yes. the night? Okay, so you guys are going to take one level of exhaustion. So you have disadvantage on all ability checks. Okay. Until you sleep. Lovely. I'm assuming you're carrying on, because you're not back with the rest of these people. Yes. Okay. You carry on. Both of you, Rangrim and Marilyn, make a perception check for me. Now we're getting random encounters. <laughs> Please, no. Uh, 20. Not natural. 12. Okay. Rangrim, you see a large group of people, probably about um, 60 in total, <laughs> coming out of the North Wind Wood, north oh, of you. Fuck. Um, they seem to be heading, um, southeast from there. Are they paying any it, mind to us? I mean, you are two people very far away from them. It's likely that they can't see you, but you do know it's kind of odd that they're not taking a road because they're, the towns you know of. Can I see like what color they're wearing? Um, if there's any sort not of from specific that color? Not from that distance. I just see, like, figures, um, okay. Yeah. By your best guess, given their direction and where they came out of, they're coming from Snowfall towards Farwater. Oh. Here's the map. Oh, pencil <laughs> fell. There's Farwater. How okay. large was the popula- population of Snowfall? It wasn't big. It was definitely, like, a town, like, a couple thousand. Okay. So, pretty small, like, maybe 2,000. Is it the Divine Watch? There's 60 they would, people. They would tend to take roads or ships yeah. to travel. Okay. You are you can't quite tell what these people are. Are they cultists? You're not sure. If the cultists were in Snowfall, then that's not good. We might go back to Snowfall, and it might be burned to the ground. Well, I thought after this we were going to head to Snow Castle. Uh, well, we were going to go to Snowfall oh, for and a get a boat. Yeah. But it might be burned. There might not be any Can we see if Snowfall. there's any smoke in the sky? Because if they burn down a whole city, you might be able to see that from a distance. Make a perception check. But I don't want everything to be burned down. Six. That would suck. You do not see any smoke. <laughs> uh, I'll make a perception check, okay. too. Watch this one suck, in, too. In the future, roll before... Someone else says, yeah, okay. Before I tell them what happens. Okay. Or preferably before you know what they rolled, just be like, roll a perception, I'm going to do that as well. Okay, that's good. Because, like, otherwise it kind of just feels like, oh, they failed, I better do it, so we know. Yeah. You yeah. know? Yeah, I gotcha. I'll keep that in mind. Okay. Um, I got 19. All right. You also see no smoke. Okay, cool. There's no smoke. Cool. Actually, I don't see any smoke. <laughs> <laughs> I don't see shit. So we should probably watch them. So are they coming at all in our direction? Vaguely. So here, you guys okay. are to the east of Cursed Lake. For our listeners, there is a picture of this on our Instagram, Twitter, and Reddit. Look at that. 
Uh, so you guys are at the east edge of Cursed Lake. They're coming from uh, the Northwind Wood towards what looks like far water. So they're headed southernly, but more southeast than straight south where you okay. guys are. So do you think we should be okay? Or should we, like... I don't know. Uh, Our only option of running would be to go in the water or to go more south. I don't... I don't think, considering that they're sneaking through the woods, I don't think they would be allied to us. Well, yeah. So uh, I don't think we should mess with them. It doesn't really seem like they're sneaking. They are, like, they do have Traversing some, like, the carts with them. Traversing through the woods in general. Okay. It seems like a It seems like a poor idea to bother them. Yeah, but I just mean, it, I'm scared they're going to notice us. I'm going to be like, can you be warm for a little can bit? Can you be warm for a little bit? I can try. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to sure. pull out my sword and extinguish it. Okay. And then, can I just like extinguish the fire? Or No, fire's still burning. <laughs> um, Shoot. I don't want to use water because I want to use this. Uh, Wood. Do I have... just let it burn down. I mean, it has been a while. Hasn't yeah, it? like it's pretty close to being done. Well, yeah, but we're worried that they're going to notice us. I was just going to, like, smother it with a blanket. You can. I think I think we'll be okay as long as it's dim. As long as it's not, like, a bonfire. Okay. Yeah, like, it's not even your guys' height. Awesome. It's, like, okay. barely to your knees at this point. That's still pretty big, isn't it? Not from that distance. Plus, not with, like, fairly large planks of wood. Oh, yeah. They're not, like, tiny stuff that you would put, like, on your flooring. Right. These are like hefty planks. Okay. Right. Like probably like four by sixes. Okay. Yeah, let's just let it burn then. And we can wait. Okay, so we're watching these people go past, I assume. Uh yes. Okay. They seem to carry on southeast. As they get closer, can we make anything else out? Um they're carrying, they're not carrying, they're with quite a few carts being dragged by horses, um, some covered, some not, some are wearing fairly nice clothes, others fairly normal clothes. Are there any children? Uh, make a perception check. Hmm. Oh, I'm so sorry, it was a 12. Um, 14? From this distance, you're not sure if they're children, gnomes, or halflings, but there are people of children's size. Because, <laughs> I mean, like, if they were traveling with children, I would think less cultists and more just, like, city people. Yeah. All right. Do they seem pretty... Well, you said they were wearing a range of clothing, so it's not like they're all cultists wearing the same thing. No. Okay. Like, some are wearing brighter co colors, which would hint at wealth. Yeah. Others are wearing brown, which is your bog standard color for the Middle Ages. Does it seem like a church organization or something? You're not there. I can, I can I was think. about to answer as well. I was like, nope, she's not there. <laughs> Do you have um, any questions? I mean, to me, it would kind of rule religion. Sure. Okay, to see if they're, like, religious. Because uh, I'm trying to see if, like, the Divine Watch would, like be in rough spun clothing like that. Or in uh, nobler clothing. I would assume not. I would assume they would be wearing the same color. But I'm gonna roll anyway. Okay. I'm going to tell you what what whatever you roll unless it's a nat one. Five. <laughs> okay. Doesn't seem to be to have any religious affiliation at all. Okay. I mean I was going to tell you. Okay. <laughs> And then I basically you decided just gave myself. To roll. I basically just gave myself five percent chance of failure. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um. Okay. Cool beans. All right. You guys sit around for a little while, occasionally, just making a few laps to keep yourself limber, stretched out, <laughs> warm. Yeah. And Vanny and Laya reappear. What'd I'm gonna you be like, find? <laughs> Hello. Um, Back early. Wait, did you just say we reappeared? Yeah, you guys walked up oh, to them. Oh, cool. Hey, what's I up? I just decided to what's be fancier all the than I needed to be. 
Uh, did they see all the people? Yeah, it's not too hard to spot now. They're I'm gonna be like, mm. not super far away. Not a religious organization. Do you know anything about these people? Either of them. Just asking in general. Laya shrugs. Uh, I probably don't know. Just curious. Everyone make an insight check if you're interested. Okay. I am in... I got a 17. I feel like we're looking too much into this. Yeah, they might just and be Jack like... Jack just doesn't even care. He's like, why do you... It's either gonna be that or these... They're like the big evil guys. Uh, oh, damn. Uh, what was it? Insight. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, yeah, that's a 23. We got okay. an unnatural 20. Okay. Vanny, do you care? Uh, yeah, I rolled a 17. <laughs> okay. You all kind of get the feeling that they're traveling merchants, but because the road from Snowfall to Farwater is kind of roundabout, they decided to make a more direct route. <laughs> straight we're through the lake. For nothing. We're like, cultists! No, just straight through the Northwind Wood. No lake involved. Alright, cool. Still might have been a little bit sketchy. Um, oh no, it's a large group of people. It's twice? a mass, like it's a massive group of people. Maybe like we can almost. travel with them and like get supplies. To and... Farwater, but we need to go to Snowfall. It's on the way, isn't it? Farwater, no. So Farwater is. Oh, here, we're going up. And if you want right. to go to Snowfall, I it's like we in the exact to... opposite direction. I thought we were yeah. going to Snow Castle. My bad. Yeah, it's on the way to Snow Castle, but yeah. we were going to take a boat to Snow Castle. So shall we head up to Snowfall? Not snow drop. Um, snowfall. Uh, I think we should go to Snowfall, and then we should see if we can take a boat. Should we try and take some of the wood with us? In the case boat we wood. Can't make it That's a good idea. Because we're gonna have to stop, right? Probably eventually. I mean, we do have your light hammer to like crush trees, but still. My war hammer. Yeah, like we could crush trees. Um, I guess if we're in the wood, yeah. but we don't want to burn the woods down. <laughs> eh. I mean, yeah. that's debatable, but... <laughs> Alright, so we're we walking to... up north to Snowfall? Yeah, I'm gonna suggest it. Do we want to go through the woods? I would suggest it's faster. Yes. It's faster, but it's like wilderness, and there's four of us. Yeah, but we won't... But there's a less chance we'll get attacked by wolves, at least. The only one I would think that's, like, good at foresty stuff is Laya. Although Laya's been in the Northwind Wood. I haven't been there much. Oh, I okay. was raised in the Grey Forest. Mm. Do you know the the wood well enough? Northwind? Not Not really. the wood, but wood in general. Like, woods in general. I mean, it, every forest is different. <laughs> but, like, what are you asking? Every forest is different. Would, Why are you asking you, me? <laughs> would you be able to help us get through the Northwind wood? I mean, if you want to go to Snowfall, head north. I mean, didn't we get here through the wood? Yeah. So shouldn't we be? Yeah, let's just head back. Mildly through the wood. okay, going back. <laughs> let's just Hopefully. head back. I think. Yeah. I think that's a good idea. That sounds good. Okay. Because I only have three days of rations. I only have two. I only have yeah. two as well. All right. So you guys start heading north. Yeah. Yep. Oh wait, do you guys have a level of exhaustion? Uh, they do. They do actually. They're pretty tired. Rest time. We should take like rest. Time. Rest. We should take time, a long rest, baby. I didn't um, hear what you said. I'm so. Sorry. We should take a long rest. We should um add to this fire. I'll put my sword back in it, and then they can rest. Okay. Well, at the if you want to do, do you have to attune to your weapon anymore? Oh, I already did. You're all done. Yeah. Okay. I didn't know if you had to do more more than once. So. No. No. Just once. Okay. So we can let them rest. Should one of us rest? Or do you think we'll be okay? Uh, no, we should rest. Uh, we could take watches. Laya can take two watches. Yeah. And then we could each take one. Sounds good to me. She votes that she sleeps first, though. Yeah, That's she fine. can sleep. <laughs> like, you sleep, you'll take the last two. I'll, okay. I'll take first watch, then. I'll take second. Okay. Um, and then I'll fire. Alright. Uh, and then that'll light the fire. So, it's probably about four hours from dusk, so you guys will wake up. At about three in the morning, if you take a long rest now. Okay. We good with that? That's I'm fine. Good. All right. So, you guys go to sleep. Who's taking first watch? Make a perception check. Oh, no. <laughs> that always scares me. 
Five. All right. <laughs> you hear this strange sound, and you look around. You can't quite find a source of it, and it's undescribable. It's a very strange sound. I'm afraid. <laughs> You taking second watch, correct? Yes. Rangram? Okay. Oh, your dog just scared me My so dog bad. Is <laughs> anyway, so you make a perception check, Rangram. Jesus. Uh We're gonna die. Eleven. Okay. You also hear a strange sound. Seems to be coming from the lake, but you can't see what on the lake or in the lake um, is watching this sound. I'll watch the lake. Doesn't seem like anything's happening. Tide seems to be coming in. This lake is large enough that it has a tide. Okay. <laughs> I'm still going to look around, but I'm going to like especially keep in mind, hey, lake's interesting. Okay. So and... the next watch is Laya, right? Yeah, mm -hmm. and then next I'm going to tell Laya that too. Okay. I'm going to be like, hey, uh, heard a weird sound from the lake. Okay. There's weird lake you sounds. go to bed? Yeah. All right. Weird lake sounds. Everyone wakes up. In the night. Good technically morning. <laughs> Thanks. That's All right. Well. So, y'all headed off to... Snowfall? Yes. Yes. Today? Yep. <laughs> okay. And you guys will have to be traveling at a slow pace, as currently there is a snowstorm all about you. I'm a freeze. Uh, it is quite cold. Who has the Ring of Warmth? Not me. Not me. No one. No one took the Ring of Warmth. Mm -mm. Uh, I have the... Boots of the Winter The lines. boots of, like, good stuff. I'm gonna, like, take out my sword, light it on fire, and then hand it to you. Thank you. I will take a flaming sword. Can I keep this... And then be like, on? uh, you're gonna want to keep Vanny close. Okay. What? Will it still stay lit if I take it? So you hand... You grab the sword? Yeah. As soon as he lets go of it... Let's go of it. The flames dissipate. That's what I would assume. Oh. I'm gonna take the sword back, okay. relight it, and be like, okay, stay close to me. Okay. Then We're all just crowded around the <laughs> Yeah. <room. laughs> I'm like, like, you can only really feel the heat five feet away, but it is quite warm. Uh, compared to the storm, like, I assume so. Like, you feel like you could take on much colder temperatures if you're this close to the sword. Mm -hmm. Do you think we should all huddle next to the sword and wait for the storm to blow over? That yeah. would take a lot of time, though. It'd probably be a good idea. We could... If you guys want to see how big this storm is, you can certainly look. Uh, I'm going to look at the storm, yeah. The nature check? Um, To see, like, how many days it would take? Yeah. Okay. For it to pass. Uh, What's my nature? My nature might, might not be good. Oh, yeah. It's a 13. You can't really see the edge of this storm other than the one ahead of you, to the north. I'm gonna be like, um... And to the west. As far as time goes, I only see one edge of the storm. I don't know if that yeah, means anything. so it's gonna be... It's gonna be a long time. Till it passes. Alright, so you do not see an end to this storm. It seems unnaturally large. Well, shit. Did we get, like, cursed? <laughs> Bad weather for us? I'm gonna be like, okay, well, I don't have enough rations to stay through this, so we might just need to press on. Does Laya have any rations? She has enough. Well, she has like three left. We're gonna okay. all die so eventually. If we get really desperate, we could like split up the last ration of whoever had like the most. I'm so glad I have food listed on this. One pound of food per day, or make food last <laughs> longer by living on half rations. Half a pound of food per day consists of half a day without food. Normal eating of days resets the count to zero. Character can go without food for three plus constitution days, minimum of one. At the end of each day, beyond that limit, a character suffers one level of exhaustion. Cool. So it's important to eat. Oof. But, like, you can go a few days <laughs> yeah. without eating. Okay, so, what's the plan? Uh, I say we press on. Yeah, uh, half Keep a ration a day. Forward? Snowstorm, that's... Okay. So, you guys travel north, and visibility is severely cut off. It's getting to, like, blizzard status around here. Blizzard. Blizzard status? Uh, I, I have the hood of my cloak oh, up. I'm trying to keep my sword, like, 
<laughs> it's lizard I'm trying to keep status. my sword like you can't lit see for shit everyone. Your limbs keep falling uh, off I'm and I'm feeling bad that I have these boots, but I don't really have any other boots. Uh, I kind of want to give them to someone <laughs> uh, for while we're doing this. Um. Cool. Audio. <laughs> All right. All right. Yeah. It's half rations a day. All right. For me. You guys. Can aren't... we just light the fire, like the forest, on fire? Like theoretically, if you stab like a tree with your sword, would it just spread? Probably. It might be a last resort. <laughs> Make a survival check. Who's leading the party? Who's leading the pack? He's got the sword. I have the sword. Make a survival check then, Rangram. Yeah, he has a sword. <laughs> you're kind of leading the pack. And it isn't necessarily difficult to get lost in a blizzard. Seven? No. Okay. You guys walk for the day. You don't. You can't really tell that it's getting dark because it's already pretty gray around you, but you can feel that you're getting tired. Let's yeah. Take a did rest. we take some of the boat with us? Yeah, we did. I think. Mm -hmm. You guys can. I'll say each of you can carry like three pieces. Vanny, you can carry one because <laughs> you are very small. Okay, so we have ten pieces. You're Vanny small. So we have ten pieces. We can probably make a fire with like <laughs> one or two, right? Just yeah. Because of how thick they are. Um. I would say yeah. If you want it to last the entire night. In this storm, you would need your blade in it, and you would need three. Do we need it to last the whole night? I mean, in the blizzard, I think Probably. So. Otherwise, okay. we're gonna die. Uh, I'm gonna... So we need three. So we basically have three nights in this wood. Four out of fire. Um, but if the or blade's in it all night... what we could do is we could just share body heat... No, by that's not how that works. Many, no. <laughs> That's hey, not how that works. Do that. It works. Please. Okay. So, you guys sleep through the night. Anyone taking watches? Uh, I'll take the first watch. You offered to take more watches since you aligned. It's yeah, I did. And also, I'm better against the cold. So. Mm -hmm. so, I think you should take one, if not two, watches. I'll take two. I'll, I'll take two. Lie, I can take the other two. I'll take right. the first one. <laughs> Um, I'm going to take the second half of the watch so that I can keep the sword lit up and try to keep the fire lit, even if we only use two pieces. Okay. Um, for for the fire, just so we can keep it lasted, keep okay. our wood lasting a little longer. Nothing happens during the night. Mm -hmm. We and, save. Yeah. I mean, you're cold, but alive. Nothing came to eat you during the night. What would everyone like to do? Shall we press on? Mm -hmm. I would okay. say press Who's on. Who's leading? Rangrim has the magic sword. He does have the magic sword. Mm -hmm. Make a survival check. All I think of us? JJ got... No, just Rangrim. Just Rangrim? I think JJ got some peanut butter stuck. <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> yeah. Don't die. He's slowly choking. <laughs> We're having Stop sandwiches choking. at 9.15 in the evening. <laughs> Make a survival check, Rangrim. Let us oh, not 20. All right. You manage to find which way is north. You walk that way. Okay. Everyone follows along. And after about 20 minutes, you feel like this is a familiar patch of snow. You think you walked along this yesterday. <laughs> this but is a familiar oh patch no. of snow. You're making your way north now. Okay. You feel very confident. We got lost you, last time. Like, now we're not lost. Yesterday, you were kind of like, is this the right way? I mean, I hope so. Today, you're like, this way's north. Okay. You go along. After about half a day, you find yourself in a forest. Pushing on. Yep. Yep. All right. You carry on. Night falls again. You are in a forest. Still blizzard? Yep. Okay. I mean, like, it's partly protected with the leaves above you. So it's not nearly so, as bad? Yeah, but, like, snow's still definitely getting through. Okay. And, like, you can fi feel the wind. But it's a lot better than through before. the trees. But, yeah. Okay. Like, 
It's cold, but at least you're not getting snowed on nearly as much. Mm. Okay. It's kind of the fact of it right now. All right, so we're half a day. I'm thinking we go the rest of the day. Sleep. Sounds oh. good to me. Cool. I'm down. No, this is like nightfall when you're. Oh, this is night. Well, like in the middle of the forest. Like you got halfway at the forest. Half day was at the forest. Oh, and then we have now gone halfway through the forest. Presumably, if this is the north wind wood. Okay. If rest? it isn't, you have gotten severely off track. Should we rest? <laughs> sure. Okay. I'm down we to got rest. Three more pieces of wood. Uh, we have. Well, we've used two. Right? You've used three. We've used three. And you had ten. So now we have seven, seven. more. Yeah. Yes. Using three more. Yes. Light a fire. Mm-hmm. Stay warm through the night. Sweet. Who's taking watches? Um. Or does it matter? Are we going to be okay? Lia's going to take two at the end. Okay. I'll take one. And then I'll take one. Okay. Who's taking first? Actually, I'm going to suggest that Vanny takes a watch. I'll, I'll still take first watch. I'll take but one. But Vanny okay. should take one. Okay. Okay. Make a perception check. Uh. Fifteen? Fifteen, you said? Yes. Okay. Uh, through the night, you see a few small, like, snow foxes. They're. Uh, they have uh, white fur. Okay. Seems like they've found and killed a rabbit. Awesome. Taking it back somewhere. What? Don't I seem will... to be too bothered by you. I'll let them do that. Okay. You go to bed, Vanny. Um, Your watch goes without incident. Okay. Also, I have an epiphany. If foxes can find rabbits and things, what's stopping us from finding rabbits and things? Well, Um, currently nothing. You guys are in the woods. uh, Well, I was going to say that it's a blizzard, so it's still going to be harder. Good point. Also, I'm no survivalist. And I lost my bow. Oh, I have also lost my bow. So. Unless. Unless you intend on jumping on top of them and stabbing um, them to death. I'll be like, um, Laya, would you be willing? Not in this weather. (laughs) Fair enough. Fair enough. Um, Like, when I was living in the, um, Grey Forest. We kind of saw these for these storms a few days ahead of time, stockpiled some food, and kind of waited however long we needed. If we ran out of food, tried to stay as close to home as possible. But it's pretty cold. Don't want to freeze out there. Good idea. Sounds good. Plus, um, we have the food anyway. Mm. Uh, well, we're doing half rations right now, right? How long is it from the Northwind Wood to Snowfall, if we're fast? Like, it's... Snowfall's right on the edge of the Northwind Wood. Okay. So once we get out of this wood, we'll be... Yeah. Like, we'll be good. from previous experiences, it's taken you a few hours to get from that tower to Snowfall, mm-hmm. and you're not sure where you are in the Northwind Wood. Got it. But... Okay. Alright. Um... Y'all wake up. Again, not entirely sure what time of day it is. You know it's not pitch black out, but it is very gray. Snow is still falling, and the wind is still blowing. Awesome. Uh, who's making... Who the, who's being the leader? Who is the leader? I'm going to say Magic I guess someone man. other than I. Um, because they can still walk ahead of me and still be within five feet. Okay, who's gonna do it then? Um, I could. Laya, I know I've asked a lot of you, <laughs> Laya. <laughs> but we all really Lord suck at wood stuff. Um, would you be willing to lead us at least so that we don't get lost? I mean, I'm not su- super familiar with these woods, but I can try. Awesome. We just need to keep going north. That's all that matters. Good point. It makes me scared if he's looking at the map like, you're gonna... No, I was looking at her stat block. Oh, okay. I was like, oh no. Would you like a carrot? I don't know about a carrot, but I might take... God. I had such a bad run-in with a carrot recently, and I cannot, like, even think of them without shivering. Oh, no. What happened? (laughs) So, like, I was like, one night, I was like, okay, it's, like, 11, but I'm kind of hungry. I'm just gonna have a snack of carrots. So I poured myself a bowl 
One looked a bit off, so I was like, oh, I'll just throw it away. Picked it up, and it, like, instantly slipped out of my hands. Oh. And I was like, it was, like, oozing. Oh, So I was God. like, oh, okay. So, like, I grabbed a fork and, like, stabbed it, and it went through like it was wet, like, hot butter. Oh. I threw away the bag. <laughs> Yeah, I, I still can't touch. I can't even think about carrots. It's so oh, bad. Gross. That's yeah. nasty. I, I, yeah, I can't do carrots. <laughs> These ones aren't squishy. Yeah, but I, I can't. I can't. We're gonna make even you get see over a your carrot fear. without like having <laughs> flashbacks. Just like <laughs> throwing carrots. Just at a little little time. I had that where like um, oh, I had that where like I was eating bread and I had spread like Nutella over it mm -hmm. and I didn't think the top was bad but then I like ate a few bites and looked at the bottom and it was just like covered in mold. Oh, so, something very God. similar to, oh, has no. happened to me. <laughs> I don't have a problem with br bread though. Like I little check extra it. penicillin. I check it every time. I do. Too. I check but, it like, now. I yeah, check it now. Before then I didn't, but like after I, I did something similar, I check it every time. Like I always so, check. Like I I can't touch a carrot still I like refuse. um yeah no i had a little bit of extra penicillin traumatized by carrots um, that day <laughs> i'm sorry if any of our listeners are eating to eating carrots right now <laughs> or or bread with stuff on it uh, it's, our apologies it's We're worse sorry. when like you spread the stuff and like you didn't notice the mold and now it's covered so you don't yeah. know <laughs> yeah. yeah now you don't know Dude, I did anyway. that with an apple. I went apple picking. I took a bite of it. There was a fucking worm. And I took my like, oh, apple worm no. off. I was like, oh god, Ooh. I wanted to die. Uh, so, our apologies now for bread eaters, <laughs> carrot eaters, and apple eaters. Shay, do you want to add something? <laughs> <laughs> add something, Shay. The only time this has ever happened to me with this was with a tortilla. A tortilla? Yes, I like a to say it like that. My mom smacks me every T time. Tell us the tortilla story. Um... I was making a fancy ass stove burner tortilla mm. quesadilla. <laughs> yep. And I just chucked them out of the bag and I just put them on the burner and I spread the cheese, you know, and I threw mm -hmm. the other one on top and I flipped it and I saw that I had cooked the mold. Oh. On side, and it made like this horrible smell, but I didn't smell it until mm. I flipped it yeah. over. Like it was gag inducing. I was like, oh, oh. Jesus Christ. All right, um, so our official apologies for <laughs> bread, carrots, tortillas, and apples. But only yeah, if you're cooking the tortillas. Um, and then one more thing, ice machines at restaurants are surprisingly nasty. Oh. Yeah. My fucking ice really machine in my house is nasty. I clean it out I every Saturday. Either. Like, it just, it's an insult unless you're drinking water. Right? Yeah. Because, like, it's just going to water down what you exactly. have. Just give me, like, the little I, plasticky thingy. Yeah. I, I just always order sans ice. Mm-hmm. Anyway. Okay, so, back on track. <laughs> um, so, she leads you onwards. Okay. Presumably north. You're not Hopefully. sure. You guys travel. About half a day later, you exit the forest. And you don't see anything around you. You can't see super far, though. Visibility is heavily scarce. Lia kind of looks around a bit nervously and decides to just keep walking in the direction she had. You guys come across a road. She seems to recognize it. Turns left and walks. I presume you all follow. Yes. All right. Yep. After another few hours, you guys walk into the familiar snowfall. Yeehaw! Yay! They have braziers there, right? They, got that they do bonfire. have the one massive bonfire, and it seems like they've piled more wood on since cool. this blizzard started. Should we it, go directly to the bonfire? To I am. <laughs> okay. And, like, out of every chimney, and there is a chimney on every building in this town, well, I would assume so. smoke is just billowing out. Presumably everyone's fires are quite large inside. Uh, I'm gonna go to the ta the bonfire, warm up a bit, okay. and then I'm gonna go to the tavern. All right. I'm going to go immediately to the tavern and yeah, profusely too. apologize to any one behind the bar. Okay, why are you apologizing to people behind the bar? Because last time we were here, I was an asshole, and I didn't expect to come back. That's so true. I better make friends. <laughs> God, what was the Barkeep's name. I don't what know. Her name? Uh, I just remember Vanny was an asshole, and, and I felt really bad. Totally, yeah, the like, guy was Tom. Out. 
The guy was Tom. Who was the woman? She had a, like interesting. Oh, Maeve. 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 I fucking like Maeve. Pretty nice to Maeve. But the young I man, Maeve. I I cursed him out. Yeah, Maeve is behind the bar at the moment. I'm just going straight. I'm what? probably we're gonna stay here a while. I'm gonna go to the library tomorrow, so I'm gonna buy a room. All right, one room. Uh, I'm actually uh, I'm gonna head in, and the first thing I'm gonna do is gonna be like um. Is there anything that I could order to eat? Yeah, of course. Uh, what's, like, what? I mean, we've got the normal stuff, the meat, a bit of bread, some cheese. <laughs> uh, can I have some hot soup? I mean, I'll see what we have. Kinda hard to get stuff like that during a blizzard, though. Okay. Anyone else anything before I go back and look? Uh... The I'll room, take right? Yeah, anything you else? Have. <laughs> no, that's it. For All right, day. five silver then. Got it. I'll um, hand that gladly over. That was for Marilyn. Vanny, oh. what did you want? Uh, anything they have on hand. Like food wise, drink wise. Uh, food wise. Food wise. Sure. And can I get a hot mold wine? <laughs> Some wine, sure. Heck yeah. Um, so for the dwarf. Don't know your name. Anyway, five silver for you, and for the food and the wine, that'll be seven silver. I'll see if I we have any am I cool. soup. Right. Wine. No, you're paying for the soup. Mm-hmm. And if we don't have any, then I'll just bring you out some food. Any any sort of food is welcome. Uh, thank you. Um, and can I, <clears throat> can, I, if, can I also have some ale? Or uh, need sure. anything warm? Ale, how much you want, mug, or just a... Mug. All right, that'll be four copper. Can I give you... Can I give you a silver and get it warmed a little? Sure. Okay. So how much does that bring me up in total? <laughs> if you're giving her a whole silver for the mug... Yeah, so that would be six silver. Six silver. And then I'll pay for the soup when it comes out. That was... This five was for the soup. Mm, got it. Okay. All right. And then... She goes back... I'm just gonna give her a gold when she comes back. Be like, I okay. like a room brings out some soup. Not very good soup, but... I don't care, I eat it all. It's pretty good. <laughs> like <laughs> Considering what you've been eating recently, like jerky, dried fruits, it's pretty good. It's warm, <laughs> Yeah, and it's soup. And so I'm happy. The it's ale is warm. It's... The wine, it's not the finest wine you've ever had, but it is there. And That's the meat's good. pretty good. Okay. You have a room. Where? Cool. <laughs> Upstairs. Does number it have six. a number? Okay. I'm just going to go to bed. Okay. Bye. Night. <laughs> All right. All right. What are you two going to do? Um, Eat the rest of my shit and I'm drink gonna the pay, rest of my wine. Uh, that's six silver, right? Mm-hmm. I'm going to pay her gold and be like, can All I right. also get a room? Sure. Can I just bunk with Rangram? Um... I'll just give her another gold and be like, can you break this? Can you yeah. break this? Thank you. I'm a tavern. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> she hands you back nine silver. Okay, Hands so you a key for number six. Sorry, no, that's what you had. Number five. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, why did my brain go to that together. one? Oh, I just told you that one, that's why. So yeah, hands you a key to room number five. Okay. Do you go cool. up? Cool. Yes. Okay. I'm gonna go up. I'm gonna go to bed. In what room, Vanny? I just said I'd bunk with Ringroom. Did you ask Ringroom? <laughs> yeah, can I bunk with you? <laughs> I'm already in my room. Fuck <laughs> <Damn> it. <laughs> Fuck it. Ah, fine. Wait, didn't you pay this lady two gold? She gave me nine silver back. Oh, okay. Alright. Well, I'm gonna walk up to anyone behind the bar. Is it uh, what's her name? Maeve. Maggie? No, it's Maeve. 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 What the hell is wrong with me? Um, I don't know. Can I get a room <laughs> as well, please? Sure, five silver. Alright, there you go. Thank you so much for your hospitality. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna go up to my room. I'm gonna Everyone go to bed. taking a long rest? <laughs> oh, yes. Alright. Two things before we finish off the episode. Well, the session, really. Yeah. That'll be a level up. And that's the end of the night.
Cool. Whoa. Well, thank you for listening to Dice Quest. My name is Jack, and I'm your dungeon master. If you want to support us, you can go to patreon.com slash dicequest.